Hello everybody and welcome to this short video. My name is Alistair Lobo, Application Specialist for Pro Structures at Bentley Systems. In the coming two minutes, we will see how to place an in-drawing path list in the drawing model. In the Steel Workflow, in the Data Reporting tab, select the Drawing Path List tool. Then, navigate to the top view and select all the paths for which you want the list. Then, specify an insertion point and the bill of materials will get generated in the model the part list, you need to select the PS properties and then in the list styles, you need to create a new list style of the part list. Give it a new name and then navigate to the layout tab. Now in the layout tab, select the newly created style. Upon selection, then click on change current style, which will then open the format dialog box. In the format dialog box, you can create the parameters that you want your new part list to look like. Here you can choose the various settings and also give in a new name for the header according to your requirement. You can also add more columns to the part list. To add a footer note, you can click on the edit footnote button and then in this dialog box, you can choose what to display in the footer. Again, you have complete control over the color and offset along with the decimal points to be displayed. In a similar manner, you can control all the color and line of the part list table. When you are satisfied with your settings, you can then click on the OK button. Thus, your end drawing part list is now created according to the parameters that you have set in the dialog box. So this is the end of the video. If you have any questions, you can comment below or reach out to the Bentley Technical Support Team. Again, thank you.